We're in the city of Santa Cruz out at the crepe place. And Megan, this doesn't have the appearance of a crepe place like I would think in my mind. Well, tell me about this place. It started as a crepe restaurant, um, but then when we moved to this location, uh, the owners had a lot of experience with bartending, and so they opened up a full bar. Um, we're also a music venue, and we have a large garden in the back that accommodates large parties. So when you guys took over, I mean, did you leave things that had been here for a long time? For the most part, yeah. The end part of the bar was original to this. Um, the flooring is pretty much almost all original as well. And how long has this been here? This building is over 100 years old, but this, um, this restaurant has been in this location for since 1990. So this is the third incarnation of the Crate Place. It started as pretty much a really, really small kitchen with a couple crate pans, uh, and that was it. And this is now our third location. Tell me about the crepes. Um, it's called the Crate Place. Correct. So is it an original recipe? Is it? Um, so, I mean, crepes in general is a pretty standard recipe. Um, crepes are just egg, flour, and milk. Uh, as far as our recipes go, we do specialize in a lot more savory crepes. What's your favorite savory crepe? <sighs> I have like a top 10. <laughs> wait, 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 okay, let me back There's up. There's a lot, we have a lot, we have a pretty large I was just menu. gonna ask you, how many crepes do you serve if you have a top 10? Uh, let's see, I think we have about 20 different savory crepes. Uh, my top favorite is probably, it's a crepe called the Alexander the Crepe. <laughs> hmm, all right. And it's a chicken and asparagus crepe um, with, there's mushrooms, uh, some roasted almonds on top. And then on the side is our signature dill sauce. Do you have a favorite sweet crepe? Uh, so my favorite though is probably one called the cinnamon swirl. Um, that is a, a crepe with white cheddar cheese, which I know sounds a little little funny, but it's Not a really a sweet it's thing. a it's a really mild cheddar, and then it has cinnamon and sugar in it, and um, it's basically like a really buttery cinnamon ball. Tell me about the back part of the place. In fact, can we go back and yeah, check out the back sure. part of the place? Oh my goodness, check this out. Yeah. What was this? <laughs> it was a house. So this is like the uh, atrium of the house or, or the kitchen? Just the, or just the living area. Is the outside part of the area <laughs> yeah, too? Yeah, let's go out there. All right. Oh Whoa! How many people do you guys, could you serve? We cater to larger parties uh, and reservations, so birthday parties, wedding receptions, things like that. We can easily fit a couple hundred people back here. Was this like added on as a part of the uh, restaurant, or was it, it here originally? It was here originally. They did add little bits here and there. We have a gardener that comes in every week and kind of fixes everything up. He's done a lot of the little decorations and then a lot of the extra planting and things like that too. So would you say more locals uh, um, come in and you know, enjoy the place or out of town? Um, we have a lot of regulars that have been coming here since 1973. Uh, yeah, they're still coming here. They still order the same crepe they got the first time they came. Um, so we definitely have a lot of that regular base. There's a lot to take in here, Megan. Yeah. Oh my goodness. And we haven't even gotten to the kitchen. Can we go into the kitchen and see the crepes being made or are they already pre-made? Uh, yeah, let's see. They might be still making them. All right. We're back in the kitchen and wow, he's, holy macro, that is a <laughs> stack of crepes right there. Oh my gosh, about how many crepes are you going through in a day? Um, I mean, I would say we definitely go through at least 100. I, I really couldn't say for sure. It really depends on the day. <laughs> oh my goodness, and so they're just flying non-stop on here, huh? Pretty much, yeah. How long yep. is it taking them to make a crepe? Does it feel like it's going pretty fast here? It does go pretty fast, yeah. It takes a couple minutes. It's yeah, a pretty out. high heat. You're you're knocking it as a simple thing. I know family members who have tried to make crepes and literally are like, are you kidding? It's the hardest thing in the world to make. <laughs> so he's making this look awfully easy.
What are some of the crepes that um, you serve here? We serve um, quite a few savory crepes. We also serve quite a few sweet crepes. Um, the crepes vary anywhere from more of a Mexican flavor to something a little more Italian. We have lots of vegetarian options. Oh, okay. um, And then obviously there's meat options as well. What's the number one crepe that you guys go through on a daily basis? I would say that would probably be the crepe pasty. The crepe. The crepe. Gatsby. Gatsby. <laughs> that, are, Little plan words. It's an Italian style crepe. Uh, it's made with chicken, sun-dried tomato pesto, uh, mushrooms, scallions, obviously some cheese. There's feta and white cheddar in there, I believe. Give me some other names of your crepes, because I like the two I've heard so far. So uh, there's the Crepe Gatsby. Like I said, the Alexander the Crepe is my yeah. favorite. Um, we have uh, the Zorba the Greek. Um, we have the Mamma Mia. Aside from crepes, and it's called the Crepe Place, but what are some of the other things you serve? We have quite a few different entree salads, so they're larger salads. Um, we have a Cobb salad, we have a Greek salad. We also offer some different appetizers. We have chicken tenders, popcorn shrimp, things like that. Nice, and what about when you know music's going on in the back or whatnot? Can crepes out there, other menu items out there as well? Yeah, definitely. Anything? We serve we serve our full menu throughout the entire restaurant, up in the bar as well as out in the garden. I hate to say it, but that sounds crepe. <laughs> it's really crepe. <laughs> it's a, see, that was so much better. My delivery was terrible. That, crepe job. No. No. Okay, that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs>